everyone, welcome to Tatler Talks. My name is Kisa Castaneda. I'm the editorial director of Tatler Homes in Asia. And joining me today is Mr. Tony DeMeyer. He is the founder of Citrack and he's joining us from Australia. Hi, Tony. Hi. <laughs> Lovely to see you. Lovely to see you too. And I'm glad you can join us all the way from Australia as well. So I wanted to, you know, we don't have a lot of time today, but I just really want to ask you a few questions, especially about how you founded your company and where it's going to be leading later on. So let's start with your journey as an entrepreneur. Tell us how everything began and how you transitioned from an entrepreneur to an inventor. Oh, right. Uh, It's out of necessity, really. Uh, Originally, I'm from Holland. So that's where I was born and raised. And I went to Canada for a little while and I finished up in Australia. And Australia is a is a big country. I was in New South Wales in Sydney first. And in 83, I came to South Australia, which is a beautiful part of Australia. And lots of wine and lots of good food and, and plenty of space. <laughs> yeah, and plenty of space for the kids. And, and there is a real outdoor lifestyle here too. And uh, I was actually in um, a window shutter business. And that led to uh, some shading um, products such as folding arm awnings and and the like, uh, which, uh, yeah, was very necessary necessary here in, in summer because it gets pretty hot. And, of course, also it gets reasonably cold in the winter. And as I said, people have a real outdoor lifestyle and they love spending time on the, on the patio and doing barbecues and things like that. You know, the weather is, uh, is not very nice. Uh, yeah, it's not possible. So uh, we would love to enclose the, those areas. And I did a few of those sort of installations and the effect is fantastic because you actually enclose an outdoor area and it becomes very, you know, user friendly. It becomes all of a sudden, you know, there's no wind. It becomes very, very nice, very cozy. Uh, the only thing is that I, in my good conscience, I couldn't leave it like that for the lady of the house, for instance, to put the blinds up is very, very difficult because they're heavy. You have to roll them. You have to have really puts, you know, lots of strength in your arms and it's tall. And so it's, it's you know, not a very nice way of doing that. So I then thought, no, I'm going to stop this. I can't sort of leave that to the household, or, you know, to just to content with that. And so I actually made some prototypes and uh, tried to figure out a way on how to develop the, the tracks and so on. And of course, in the beginning, everything was handmade. Mm. But when I installed it, it was a huge success. Also that it was spring loaded. So all you had to do was actually push it up and pull it down, stops wherever you leave it, and it's very easy to operate. So that was a huge success. And soon enough, people began, you know, ringing me because I used to put, of course, a little sticker on the blinds uh, with a telephone number. Oh, great, smart. Yeah, which is marketing at its very basic and most effective way. Mm -hmm. And, yes, so people were ringing me from, you know, all over the country, basically, in Queensland. Where can I get these? Who makes them? You and, And so on and so on. So that's how it started. Of course, also, you know, people from, uh, especially with the Internet, uh, people from outside Australia also started to take notice. And now we, we export to some 14 countries. So it's been a huge uh, success, yes. That's great to hear. Um, you mentioned that um, it's, it's very easy to operate. The lady of the house, even probably children can you know, stop the blind, raise it up very, very easily. So tell us a little bit more of when you were making the prototype, like, What do you think really makes it super different from the other track lines products in the market today? Well, for a start, uh, like other track guided systems that came onto the market afterwards, we're working also with part of it, part of the track system 
being made out of plastic, out of PVC. Now, that's maybe a little bit easier, but by no means is it strong enough to, you know, especially on high rise buildings where you have a lot of wind, uh, where it's very important to have a very robust system. So we actually partnered with an extrusion company that was able, because it's very difficult, but it was able to actually extrude a track with a very fine slot in it to actually accommodate um, our, our spline. So, and that was really um, the start of, of the mass production of, of zip track blinds, yes. Okay, makes sense. Um, and it's good that, you know, of course, strength is important when, if it's windy or sometimes if it rains, you want to protect that extra room, as you were saying. So um, creating more space has been very, very important over the last 18 months because of the pandemic. So apart from that space and creating, you know, enclosing it, what other benefits do you think homeowners will get with, with ZipTrack? Well, with ZipTrack, of course, you get also insulation. So, of course, you keep uh, the room behind the balcony, for instance, much cooler. And it's the same with uh, interior blinds, as you might know that we are also have developed an interior blind system, uh, which is actually sealed all the way around, rather than the general roller blind, which is, of course, has slots on either side and at the bottom, and even at the top where the roller is generally, there are gaps. So of course, the air between the blind and the glass heats up and then starts a convection. So the hot air rises, comes out and it sucks cold air in the bottom and so on and so on. And it keeps going like that. So what we actually do is we have it sealed all the way around. So it's actually still that then actually uh, that then becomes an insulator. So that space, that closed space. So that keeps the area inside much cooler. Yeah. So that's, and of course, very relevant to Singapore high rise living. Yes. Definitely. You mentioned that, um, of course, in Australia, it's very well known and people all over the country called you when they saw the, your phone number and also how incredible the product is. And now it's available in 40 countries, including Singapore and the rest of Southeast Asia. Could you share a little bit more about your partnership with Europe Lines and maybe some challenges, that if you had any challenges entering the Singapore market? Yes, of course, Europe Lines, uh, you, you probably know that they were involved to a, in, in a, to a certain extent already with uh, glass enclosing um, balconies also. But of course, that's a, a very, uh, well, expensive and also a very, uh, it's a big undertaking to actually, you know, put glass all the way around a balcony. And then they became aware of the zip track. You have also a choice of different fabrics. So instead of just having, say, clear PVC uh, to keep the rain out, you also have uh, various uh, fabrics that will actually keep the sun out. So that's, of course, is a big plus, uh, because even if you enclose it with glass, you still have to keep the sun out somehow. If not, it becomes like a little hot box. Yes. So, yeah. <laughs> so, um, so that was, you know, they, of course, very, very well aware of all, all these advantages. And they are very good operators, very smart operators, very thorough. And I must say they're very thorough because they do their research and they did a lot of research before they actually uh, came on board and they've done a marvelous job and which is, it's, is astonishing actually. They are beautiful people to deal with and they do a fantastic job in Singapore. I'm sure they must tell you, of course, also of the needs of um, Singaporeans and the way people live here. As you know, we have a lot of high rise buildings, a lot of penthouses that definitely need your products. Could you tell us a little bit more about how you adapted um, your products or how you created something new for the Singapore market? Yes, well, of course, we developed in conjunction 
uh, with Europe Lines, we uh, made it a panel view, which is uh, because, of course, you must be aware that there's only so much you can take up an elevator, say, to the 20th floor, for instance, and uh, there's a limit to what you can take. So what we did was we uh, developed a joining system. So you can actually take the blinds up in two pieces and therefore go up uh, to the floor uh, where you live and then actually put it back together. And uh, so you actually don't need posts every three meters, for instance. Mm. So it's a, it's a very good system and it's very uh, unusual. Uh, but this only goes to show you the flexibility that we have, uh, that we can actually do this. And we have uh, a team of uh, three engineers in-house, so they are always there, ready, and developing better ways and new ways and new products. That's very clever because I think sometimes when homeowners buy things, the last thing on their mind is how it's going to enter their house. So whether you're renovating or whether you're exactly. starting a house from scratch, you, they, you know, they sometimes you actually have to haul it up um, from the window. So that's that's really clever invention from your side. Yes, and, and uh, we're very proud of that. And uh, thanks also to the Lines because they insisted, and you know, and we it made us want to do this. Yes. Yes. And also, you mentioned three engineers and research and development must be very, very important to ZipTrack. And longevity has always been a very, very important for you right from the beginning. And buying things that last is, is one of you know, the most sustainable acts that someone can do. Could you tell us a little bit more about how, how sustainability is important for, for ZipTrack? Yes, absolutely. I mean, personally, I just, I totally dislike this throwaway mentality. So we would like to actually instill in our product a long liberty, which is it's going to serve you and uh, serve you well for many, many years to come. After all, it's a, quite a sizable investment and uh, the benefits are, are huge. Uh, so, but we want to make you happy for a long, long time to come. So that is very important. That's also the reason why we always thinking about what else can we do? What else can we add? Or what else can we possibly make it more comfortable? And for that reason, for instance, we have uh, designed some brushes inside the new pelmet that we have designed. And the brushes, they first of all, they keep the blinds very clean as you move them up and down, they actually get cleaned at the same time. But also they keep out all the bugs and all the, you know, the the, uh, the you know, flies and so on that you might get, you know, in the, in the evening, especially with mosquitoes and so on. So it's, uh, we never stop thinking about things. And so we, for that reason, you know, we have, uh, we have three engineers on staff uh, that are always uh, sort of looking and thinking and we come up with ideas. By the way, we get most of our ideas from customers mm. because they love the product, but sometimes they think it's a little bit wanting of something and we then react and make sure that their wishes are fulfilled. So it's a very, very good way of doing it. It's nice. Well, that's great because as, as we know, you know, the next generation, so not only the millennials, but the Gen Z generation, sustainability is a very, very important factor for them when it, when it comes to purchasing or supporting a company. So it's good that you have that dialogue with your consumers. Yes, well, I myself, I'm a baby boomer. So I've lasted quite a while. <laughs> <laughs> so, and I like my product to also last a long time. So... Tony, you mentioned earlier that ZipTrack in Australia, you're able to create an extra room. And here in Singapore, where space is at a premium, you know, not, not all of us have sprawling um, homes here in Singapore. COVID-19 and the pandemic has really increased the demand for space. Can you tell us how ZipTrack will help Singaporean homeowners create an extra room, for example? People, because of the pandemic, 
spend a lot more time at home, uh, which is necessary. And of course, that there is nothing like focus, focusing on things at hand. So you're actually at home and things will come to the fore that you maybe fleetingly were thinking about before. But now that you spend all this time at home, you think, oh, now's the time to do something about this. And of course, uh, by enclosing a balcony, it actually gives you another area, another place where kids can play or where, you know, you can just sit out of the kitchen and maybe just relax for a minute and read the paper or read your favorite magazine. So it is very important that, you know, you create the space for yourself and that is very easily achieved uh, with Durablines and of course ZipTrack. Yeah, so that will actually enclose an area and will give you that extra space. Uh, so instead of maybe having to move house or maybe, you know, be all everybody in one room or two rooms, you actually have another area where you have a choice to actually escape to or to just sit down and put your feet up for five minutes. Look, I love Singapore. I've been there a few times now. And uh, even been in your zoo oh, and nice. held, held a big snake. <laughs> I think it took about three people to hold this, and it was enormous. And it was uh, that was very very fond memories of uh, of Singapore. And it's a lovely city. It's, it's nice and clean and uh, easy to get around, and lovely people. So, and I love the food. Of course, food yeah, market. all of us love the food. Fantastic, <laughs> yes. And uh, now this, it's I enjoy it always. And uh, Europe lines, the people are beautiful, and uh, we enjoy working with them. And, and we have a long, long future together. I'm sure. I'm sure as well. Well, looking forward to welcoming you, welcoming you back here in Singapore. And we'll probably Europe lines and Tatler Homes will definitely take you somewhere interesting and hopefully memorable for you. Thank you so yeah. much, Tony. You're very welcome. Thank you. Bye. Bye for now. Bye for now.